What's up, you guys? My name is Mary I'm with Five Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free channel of the reading. Pass this out to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Uh, free general of the reading. Thanks, everybody, for all the um, new subscribers. Um, we're at like 10,720 right now. So thanks for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just a bomb.com. If you'd like to donate, it's five pieces to row five. The link's in the search box below. PayPal only. No cash, no Venmo. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was, it's a free general collective reading, so only take the messages to resonate and leave the rest. Um, the channel message I received was, um, someone's lingerie business is about to tank into the ground. Um, and then I heard um, they stole ideas from someone else. And then I heard 200 pounds and more. Now, I don't know what the 200 pounds and more has to do with a lingerie business. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, how that resonates, um, this could be for you or somebody you're connected to. Um, somebody stole some kind of lingerie uh, ideas. Um, it could have been physical lingerie ideas they stole or the idea or maybe the name or the logo or et cetera, et cetera, from somebody else, um, how that resonates. But um, their lingerie business is about to tank in the ground. It could be yours or somebody you're connected to. Maybe you know this person um, that did this. Um, but um, 200 pounds and more. I have no clue. Well, I, I can tell you how I feel it could go. There's a couple ways I feel it could go. I heard 200 pounds or more. So I plug them in just like y'all have to in your own life. Um, so when I get on here and I hear these downloads, I plug them in the way I feel it could go. Of course, you have to plug them in the way, if it is your story, you have to plug them in the way they need to go um, if it is your story. So 200 pounds or more, I feel it could be the owner or a co owner, possibly, if it is a co owning situation or primary ownership situation of this business, maybe. They are 200 pounds or more because that is obviously significant in this lingerie business that's about to take it to the ground. Um, so I feel the owner or co owner, if it is a co owner situation or etc., 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 maybe they are 200 pounds or more, possibly masculine or femme. I didn't hear if it was masculine or femme owner or co owners or etc. Or maybe somebody now. I also feel it might be plus size models that are 200 pounds or more, maybe, um, modeling this lingerie. But the thing is, is there's many sexy plus size models out there. Many, many sexy plus size models. Um, so I don't feel it's a plus size 200 pounds or more model making the business go down. I feel it might be an owner or a co-owner that has stole this idea, this lingerie concept or lingerie logo or lingerie slogan or um, or lingerie ideals from someone else um, that is 200 pounds or more is what I'm feeling. Because I don't feel it's a plus size model thing. Um, I really don't. I mean, I'm 160 pounds. Um, I'm not 200 plus, but I mean... I love plus size models. I think plus size models are great. I mean, for some, I guess it could be maybe the models they're putting in um, to model their um, their merchandise. But I don't think it is with the second one, second download about they stole the idea from someone else. So I don't think it is the mo a plus size model issue. I think it is that they're getting receiving negative karma in the universe because they have stole they created a business out of false ideals that it was not their original concept is what I'm trying to say. And I think they might be 200 pounds or more or someone they're in business with is 200 pounds or more, but somehow 200 pounds or more is significant in this. So you plug it in, however it resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, just saying, just saying. Okay. The path reversed, number eight could be a very significant number in one's life. Number eight, it could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number. Um, number eight, the path reversed.
is about to cause cycles to be stuck. But negative karma com coming from the universe. Okay, I heard it's about to cause cycles to be stuck, but negative karma coming from the universe. So this person or people that created this lingerie business off of five false, not their ideas, basically. They created it off of somebody else's idea or ideals. Um, but they went ahead and did it. Um, they could have went as far as copywriting. Uh, they probably did to get the business running. Um, I don't know. Everybody's life situation is different. Only you know your story. Only, you know, you know your story, not anybody else. So I'm just a messenger. Don't shoot the messenger. But um, I heard it's negative karma from the universe because they have done this. So, yeah, I don't think the 200 pounds plus is a plus size model issue. I think it is a person that is either a primary owner or a co-owner of this company um, is what I'm feeling. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. Or maybe somebody 200 pounds or pl plus is going to, um, when their business tanks and they start losing everything, maybe they deliver them foreclosure notices or um, or something of that nature. But somehow 200 pounds plus is significant with somebody entering this person's life or maybe this person is 200 pounds plus. I heard their cycles is about to be stuck. And... Um, but it's negative karma for the universe. So the path reverse is basically their cycle's about to be stuck because their business or businesses is about to take them to the ground. Some kind of lingerie business. Spirit messages you have reflected. Wisdom upright, number 22, could be a very significant number in one's life. And we have release upright, number 27. Um, I heard the cycles are going to be stuck. This business is about to basically just tank. It's about to tank. Come on, baby, you can come over. Number 22 or 27 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Hold on. Come on. Come on. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date birth number, possible social security card number, possible green card number. I love you too. 22 or 27. Release upright. Wisdom upright. A very significant person is about to deliver this person very wise information to let it go and let it go quickly. Okay, I heard a very significant person is going to deliver this person information to let it go and let it go quickly. So to let the lingerie business go and let it go quickly um, is what I'm presuming here. And one of these people is going to have to repay back a very, 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 very large amount of money. They are going to be very, very, very upset about this. Oh, my God. Okay, so... Um, you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody coming towards this person or people that either owns or co-owns this lingerie business, um, but they stole the idea or ideals from somebody else. Of course, they're not going to tell nobody that, um, but somebody did. Um, but their negative karma is their business is tanking, and it sounds like it's going quick. It's, I mean, I'm serious. But somebody coming, it sounds like it hasn't happened yet. It sounds like it's about to. This, all these messages sound like it's upcoming. Um, but whoever this is, this person that's about to come towards this owner or co-owner, uh, possibly 200 pounds or more, is what I'm feeling. Or maybe this person coming towards them is 200 pounds or more. You have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, they're going to give them wise advice, wisdom upright, to release the business and release it quickly. So now whether... If this is for you and you have this lingerie business or somebody you're connected to, whether they listen to the advice or not, that is their free will. Um, but somebody coming towards them. Now, I don't know if it's a, a member of a legal team, a lawyer. I don't know if it's um, a family member, a friend. Um, now, you know, you can get good advice or not good advice. And that's just the truth. So I don't know if the advice they're giving is good wisdom or smoke up their butt. I'm not sure. Um, 
it sounds like it might be good wisdom though. It sounds like it might be good, good wisdom um, from the spiritual downloads is what I'm feeling because this person probably knows that they stole all this crap from somebody else um, is what I'm feeling. I didn't hear that. That's just my deductive logic and reasoning. Um, so I feel it might be good advice. But you can get bad advice from people is what I'm trying to say. So um, however that resonates, but however that resonates, there is a significant person about to come towards this person when this starts happening. It sounds like it hasn't happened yet. It's about to. Um, and the downloads I've been receiving recently have been happening very quickly in the universe. So I feel it probably is going to happen soon. But you plugged in how it resonates. But however it resonates, they're going to come towards this person. Like I said, whether they are a professional person, a family member, a friend, you know, what have you. They're going to give them advice, wisdom to release the business and to do it quickly. So now whether this person takes the advice or not, that is their free will. Um, and that's the release energy too, um, releasing the business. And I heard this person, um, person or people that has this lingerie business, but it's like very fraudulent lingerie business. Um, I heard they're going to have to repay back uh, basically a shit ton of money. I mean, it's not a little amount of money, and they're going to be pissed about it. So I feel they could, they probably got a loan. They probably got a loan out for this business, or it might be a PPP loan. And I didn't hear it was a PPP loan. PP, bleh. I didn't hear it was a PPP loan, but it might be. Um, but I feel it's some kind of loan energy. Um, possibly. I didn't hear it was a loan. But I feel it might be. Um, it's some very, 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 very large amount of money. They're going to have to pay back. So probably a loan. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. And that's the release of energy too, having to pay back all this money. You plug it in how it resonates. And the wisdom that they're going to have to pay back this money. And it could be this person coming towards them, giving them the wisdom that they're going to have to pay back this money, whether they want to or not, you know, possibly. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so much. Everybody made wonderful choices, and I'm going to say.